Hey, it's Mark. In this video, I'm going to show you how to recover deleted posts on Facebook. We'll do this on mobile, and then I'll show you on desktop. And I'll also show you how to save a copy of your data so you'll never lose it again. So let's say you posted something on Facebook, deleted it, you decide you want to restore it to your profile. Here's how to do that. On mobile, I'm on an Android phone here. You press on your profile up in the top right, and you're going to go into your settings tab. Under settings, you're going to scroll down a little bit to your activity log, which is in this your information section. Click on activity log, and then you'll see a trash can icon up top. Click on that trash right there. Um, and you'll, you see that I posted a few things, deleted them, and maybe like, oh, actually, I changed my mind. I want to put that back on my profile. So one of them says bubblegum ice, bubblegum's the best flavor. This is an ice cream channel. I click on the three dots on the right. And then there's an option where you can permanently delete it if you want, or you can just click restore to profile. It's going to make sure you want to restore that. If you're sure, you just click restore right there, and then that's back on your profile. So that's how you restore a deleted post on mobile. Now, before we hop over to desktop, I'm going to show you how to download a copy of your own data from Facebook on mobile. So if you, you know, Facebook crashes or something, who knows? You've got your own copy of all that content that you've been publishing over time. So back here, if we go back to our profile on the settings, you're going to go back into your settings like I showed you before with the activity log. It's in the same uh, area that says your information down here. And then you click on download your information. It'll ask you if you want to download messages, events, you know, groups, reels, pages. There's all sorts of stuff. I've got a checkbox next to all of them. And if you do want to download all of that, you pick the format you want. You can have either HTML or JSON there, and then you can pick the media quality you want to download it. So you just create a file. You can save it on your desktop, computer, wherever, on a thumb drive, whatever you want to do. So that's how you do it on mobile. Now we're going to hop over to desktop, and I'll show you how to do it there. All right, so now we're on desktop, and it's the same process to re restore a deleted file and also download your information. You're going to click on your profile image up here in the top right. So click on that. You're going to go to Settings and Privacy. So the menu is a little different. It's a little simpler here, actually. I didn't have to scroll through as many options. Click on Activity Log. So in there, you'll see um, on the left-hand side, if you scroll down, it says Trash right there. And then you can go into your trash. You can see, you know, at one point I kept changing my mind. Bubble gum was my favorite flavor, coconut, vanilla. I'm like, hey, actually, you know, coconut is the best flavor. So I click on the three dots and I can just click restore to profile right there. So if I click restore to profile, it's going to ask if I'm sure. If I'm sure, I just click that blue button and I can restore it to my profile. So that's how you recover something that you've deleted. So now I'm going to show you how to download all of your information, posts, reels, comments, whatever you put on Facebook. If you want to save it offline, off of Facebook for your own record, so you'll never lose it again. Maybe you have some cool pictures, videos, things that you want to make sure are never lost. So you click on your profile image up in the top right. You go on to Settings and Privacy, then click on Settings again. And we're going to scroll down on the left-hand side. <clears throat> Let's scroll down a little bit here. There's this section called Your Information. And then it says, just like on mobile, download your information. So you click that. You can pick the format you want on there for downloading. The media quality, date range. You've got to pick whatever date range. And then what sort of things, activity, messages, you know, you name it, places, pages you want to download. Go all the way to the bottom, and then you can request a download. Also, last note, if you put something in the trash on Facebook, it will be deleted after 30 days. If you want to delete it faster than that, you can go into your trash can, select that item, and press delete. But it will be deleted after 30 days, and you can't recover it. It's just gone off of the Facebook servers. I hope that video is helpful for you. So you'll never lose anything again on Facebook if you want to restore it or save your information. If you liked this video, give it a like and subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you again soon.